टुडे वी विल लर्न फोकल पॉइंट नोडल पॉइंट एंड प्रिंसिपल पॉइंट एंड फोकल प्लेन नोडल प्लेन प्रिंसिपल प्लेन ऑफ ए लेंस सो लुक दिस इज अ लेंस दिस इज अ लेंस दिस इज इट्स प्रिंसिपल एक्सिस नाउ इफ आई टुक इफ आई टुक ए पैरेलल रे ऑफ लाइट कमिंग फ्रॉम इनफिनिट ओके ए पैरेलल रे ऑफ लाइट कमिंग फ्रॉम इनफिनिट आफ्टर रिफ्रैक्शन ऑन द फर्स्ट सरफेस इट जस्ट डाइवर्टेड लाइक दिस ओके नाउ अगेन इट रिफ्रैक्टेड ऑन द सेकंड सरफेस अगेन इट विल डाइवर्ट लाइक दिस ओके नाउ इफ आई फर्दर proceed the incident ray then it is traveling like this it is traveling like this and the final refracted ray if i took back the final refracted ray that is uh, this is the incident ray it is refracted ray फर्स्ट रिफ्रैक्टेड रे इट इज फाइनल रिफ्रैक्टेड रे ओके नाउ इफ आई ड्रो द फाइनल सॉरी इफ आई टू द फाइनल रिफ्रैक्टेड रे टू बैक इन द बैकवर्ड डायरेक्शन देन इट विल जस्ट टॉच इट ओवर हेयर बोथ द इंसिडेंट रे द incident ray and the refracted ray final refracted ray will meet at this point if this point is called <coughs> h2 this point is called h2 and if i draw a perpendicular from this point to the principal axis where the principal axis and the perpendicular will touch that point is known as principal point 2 okay that point is called principal point or second principal point okay second principal point what is second principal point if i draw the incident ray if i further uh, took the incident ray uh, towards <coughs> uh, towards uh, sorry if i further Then what's the uh, incident ray and draw back the final refracted ray? Then they will meet at at a point and from that point, if I draw a perpendicular upon the principal axis, then where the principal axis and the perpendicular will touch, that point is known as second principal point. Now the H two P two is the normal and this H two P two is called principal. Plane. Okay, that is second principal plane. So how can we call? How can we find out the first principal point? The first principal plane. If I take a ray of light coming from this point, this point, a incident ray is coming through this point, traveling towards the. lens and at a first surface at first surface it will refract like this and again after uh, in the second surface it will refract parallel to the principal axis it will refract parallel to the principal axis and if i draw the incident ray like this and the final refracted ray it will meet at this point this point is known as h1 this point is known as h1 and if i draw a perpendicular from this point to the principal axis they uh, at that point of touching the principal axis and the uh, perpendicular from h1 to the principal axis that point is known as p1 that point is known as p1 or it is also known as p1 is also known as first 
प्रिंसिपल पॉइंट फर्स्ट प्रिंसिपल पॉइंट एंड एच वन पी वन इज द फर्स्ट प्रिंसिपल प्लेन अंडरस्टूड नाउ यू हैव क्लियर व्हाट इज सेकंड प्रिंसिपल पॉइंट एंड फर्स्ट प्रिंसिपल पॉइंट सेकंड प्रिंसिपल पॉइंट व्हाट इज सेकंड प्रिंसिपल पॉइंट इफ ए रे ऑफ लाइट कमिंग पैरेलल विद प्रिंसिपल एक्सिस आफ्टर इंसिडेंट सॉरी आफ्टर रिफ्रैक्शन इट विल ट्रैवल लाइक दिस इफ आई ड्रॉ फर्दर द इंसिडेंट रे एंड द रिफ्रैक्टेड रे विल बी ड्रॉ बैक देन एट अ पॉइंट दीस टू रेज आर मीट from these two uh, sorry from this point if i draw a perpendicular upon the principal axis where the perpendicular will touch the principal axis that point is known as principal point 2 and if i uh, um, incident a ray of light through a, through the focus of the lens then it will after refraction it will travel parallel to the principal axis and if we uh, draw further the incident ray incidented through a focal lens and Uh, if we draw back the refract final refracted ray then it will meet at point h1 from h1 i have drawn the uh, <coughs> perpendicular upon principal axis and that point where the principal axis uh, is touched by the perpendicular drawn from h1 that point is known as principal point understood now look what is focal point or focal or focus so a lens has two two focus one is in the left side of the principal plane uh, sorry principal point another one is in the uh, right side of principal plane <coughs> principal point so every distance is measured from the point principal principal point now this is a lens this is its principal axis which dividing the lens horizontally in equal two parts if i consider a point like this if i consider a point there is a point so through this point i have through this point i have incident array i have incident array after incidenting it will refract like this and again it will refract in the second surface and after refraction it will travel parallel to the principal axis parallel to the principal axis then that i have considered the point which point i have considered that point is known as the principal focus so i have considered a point here over here this point is let be f through that point i have uh, <coughs> incident a ray of light after incident it will refract like this and after final refraction it will travel parallel with the principal axis then that point i have considered that point is known as focus so if you take a ray of light like this then it will also travel parallel to the principal axis every ray of light incidented through the point focus it will after refraction it will travel parallel to the principal axis okay now what is the second focus if a parallel ray of light coming from infinite after refraction it will travel like this and again it will travel like this at the point of touching the <coughs> principal axis that point is known as f2 focal length 2 that is focal length 1 that is focal length 2 okay so here is focal length 2 okay so it is principal focus 1 it is principal focus 2 now if i draw a perpendicular over here that plane is known as focal plane and again if i draw a perpendicular over here that plane is known as focal plane two okay now what is nodal point now look what is nodal point 
you have understand that focal point, focal point, principal point. Now, look what is nodal point. <coughs> this is a lens. This is its principal axis. If a ray of light coming like this, making an angle theta with the principal axis. Now, if I consider it over here, a point P, it will refract like this. Again, this will be P1 and this will be P2. From P2, it will emerge like this. Emerge like this. Okay. So, sorry. It will make an angle theta with this plane. So, if this plane is theta, then this point, these points, P1 and P2, is called the nodal points N1 and N2. That means, <coughs> the incident ray and refracted ray if they are parallel then the point of incidence is called nodal point okay that means incident ray and refracted ray are parallel if incident ray and refracted ray are parallel then the incident point p1 and the refracted point p2 these are called nodal points okay now just remember a trick that is <coughs> if the lens is separated by a medium that is if it is air medium over air and it is also air medium then nodal point lie on principal point that is P, P1 equal to N1 and P2 equal to N2 Understood? Okay, thank you. Handwritten notes PDF is given in the description box. Please download it.